art. If you talk about art, art has a lot of forms, but it really plays a lot of uh, significant role in our human civilization. Sometimes it can, the way how you feel, to communicate the way what you want to say without even saying it. But actually, in fact, by, you can see on the news that people in society, there is a lot of people that still don't understand what about art, what art is. So it's really ironic that we express our feeling, we communicate. So we try to solve it with Lukita. So hi, my name is Fadil Jacksono. Welcome to Lukita. And these are our member. My name is Ardelia Safira Wedo Putri. My name is Lashita Zahra. Hello, my name is Putu Swarana. Hello, my name is Prima Gian. And my name is Ahmad Sarudin. Now we're gonna talk about the application. Lukita is a personal art gallery application that uses advanced technology to predict and describe artworks when you scan or upload an image. It analyzes the visual feature to determine the art type, style, and other relevant details. Here's the reason why we should use Lukita. Art gallery. You can explore captivating artworks, diverse genres, and art description on it. Image or painting scanner. Effortless digitize your image or paintings and instantly view the result. Art prediction. The image of art prediction aim to offer a visual glimpse into the expert outcome, helping users to gain insight or understand the potential artistic direction. Similar image. Use the fire-related or visual-related image based on characteristic of a given image. By identifying similar image, user can discover related image. This is a workflow from the machine learning division. The first is the planning, data collection, and data pre-processing stages. We create a new data set with six art movement classification and each class contain 50 images. Following creating the convolutional neural network architecture, we try to make several models and saw the most satisfying result. The third stage is training with the convolutional neural network model that was made before. Of course, in the future, we will continue to develop the model and its accuracy. The fourth stage is art movement prediction. To test the model we have made, we try to run art movement prediction. After trying to upload an art image, the results of the prediction of the art movement will appear along with a description of the art movement. Next, there is a similar art show. After the art movement prediction is executed, similar images will also be displayed. The final stage is the export of the model that has been made into H5 and the flight from which will be deployed to mobile device by the cloud computing. So right now we're going to talk about the result of the model that we have built. So we have made a 12 attempts in the real world implementation. We get a 9 out of 12 right. It means we have 75% accurate. I know it's not really promising at the first moment, but we look at the future that we have a lot of chance in the future, right? So we're going to see the look forward for the promising horizon in the future. Cloud computing serves as a critical backbone for the Lukita application, enabling it to offer a wide array of features and deliver a seamless user experience. And then here's our architecture cloud computing. First, in mobile you can log in or sign up. In this section, we are using Firebase authentication. Then you can see the gallery. Here's you can scan or upload image. Then process in the machine learning model that has been deployed using Google Cloud Run. Then for similar image, will be processed from Google Cloud Storage. And here's the cloud computing result. We deploy the machine learning model using Cloud Run and the dataset image are saved in Cloud Storage. For the login or sign up, we're using Firebase Authentication. From mobile equipment side, Lukita used several tools including Android Studio, both with Kotlin programming language and using Jetpack Compose as a framework. And there are several libraries that we use such as Camera X, Retrofit, Firebase, Dell Daggers, and Material Design. And this is Lukita Mobile App. There are several displays, including the first it is open, will be directed to login or register. Next, we will enter the main picture, named Gallery Art. There are many pictures of painting with various types of art style here. Next is the main picture that makes this app unique. Scan art. This feature is used to classify image. 
based on art style. After scanning, we will direct you to the template for more information. You can scan this QR for more information about our documentation in GitHub. The next, I will explain about our business plan such as project milestone, budgeting, and needed resources. For project milestone, we're beginning in July with survey to improve feature and release the alpha version with better description of art with my gallery. Then in August, we're going to improving and creating new feature, which is art movement type guessing game. In October, we're going to submit a cooperation proposal to the museum and action of the Lukita app at the museum and activate membership program. Last in December, we are released the beta version of Lukita app. Aspect of the roadmap are For subscription, we present the free member and the membership Lukita by paying 10,000 rupiah with no ads, free gallery access, unlimited art predict, art description, and similar art. Revenue projection is the estimate of expected revenue for a certain period of time in the future. Here's our revenue projection. There is also our target market at 15 to 24 years with the professions. First, cultural tourism, known as travelers who are interested in exploring art and culture during their visits to new places. Also like to prioritize cultural experiences and exploration during their travels. Second, an art enthusiast or aesthetic, known as a person who has or affects to have a special appreciation of art and beauty. Third, white community. They are the future of our target market, who is interested in art regardless of their level of expertise or background. There are several reasons why our target needs our solution. First, for the purpose-driven, there are increasing art appreciation. From the background that we already highlighted before, we know that appreciation of art decreases. With Lukita, we hope it will increase art appreciation at all ages. Then, cultural education. Art education is very important, especially in our country. That's why we need Lukita to gain more knowledge about art especially about art movements. The last one is bridging knowledge gaps. Second, for the data-driven, there are user behavior analysis. With Lukita, we also do user behavior analysis. For example, we could know about someone's favorite art movement. Then, artwork categorization. As we know, one of Lukita's feature is to do art movement categorization or prediction. The last one is impact assessment. Third, for the government reasoning. There are cultural preservation and promotion. With Lukita, we could do cultural and art promotion to introduce more art to society. Then, economic development and creative industry. The last one is democratizing art and education. Provide easy access to all users, anytime and anywhere. Here is a slight picture of budgeting one with $5,000. There are three main categories, namely team salary, research operation, and investment. With each subcategory, each subcategory has its own portions. With a total amount of $5,000 or 70 million rupiah. And here is a flat picture of budgeting 2 with $10,000. We made 7 categories and each category has its own portion. With a total amount of $10,000. Uh, kalau ada aplikasi itu ya bermanfaat sekali ya karena kan makin kesini kan dunia teknologi kan semakin canggih digital apalagi karena nggak 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 melulu kita selalu tradisional terus nanti kita kalau tradisional terus nanti kita ketinggalan sama orang luar bermanfaat banget mas soalnya saya juga belum terlalu paham soal lukisan kan terus alirannya juga apa saya juga belum terlalu paham jadi dengan adanya ini ya bisa membantu banget buat orang-orang yang belum paham lukisan. Lukita is not just an app, it's a catalyst for change. We strive to reduce the gap of knowledge in a society about art. We, the bridge of education, we want to elevate the underappreciated art. Lukita, your personal art gallery.